Hey, what is up, Pirates? It's your boy, Scurvy, and today we're going to be taking a look at parents trying school lunches. Let's get into it. Get ready for that puke shot. I'm definitely not a nutritionist, but I care about what my kids eat and what I eat. We get a calendar every month that lists the breakfast and lunch that she gets at school, and it looks good. I remember the cafeteria lunches growing up being really bland and dry. They tasted like cardboard. She's in the same school district as I was, so hoping they improved. I'm sure it'll be some sort of combination of processed and heated foods, and then maybe like a token vegetable or fruit. If you really care about what's in your kid's lunch, you won't let them get the school lunch. It usually tastes like cardboard, and I guarantee there is no nutritional value in it. This is a substance I'm not familiar with. Can somebody tell me what this is? See? Blob. And it smells like nothing. Nothing. Just tastes like beige. That looks like the Krabby Patty from Spongebob when it's made with sand as a filler. Seriously, this is what they give at school? It says fruits, grains, vegetables, protein, dairy. My only question is, is if this is what we're supposed to be eating, does this chicken salad sandwich reflect that? I'm not excited about this. Not at all. This is definitely like a microwaved moment right now, I can tell. Oh, it's so gross. The sandwich looks like a scrotum. Meatballs look like they can bounce. This tastes like it was prepared maybe a month ago. I can plug my nose when I try it, right? It bounced. No, one no joke, at my elementary school, people swore the cheese on the pizza was rubber, so one kid took off the cheese and made a ball out of it, and it literally bounced like a bouncy ball. Season this, obviously, this is like tiny water balloons in my mouth right now. Nobody ever eats the school vegetables. Most kids already don't like vegetables, so there's no way you're going to get them to eat these nasty looking school vegetables. It tastes a little dishwatery. Very sad corn. Where did they find this? To fall off a truck or something? I would probably just eat these. Let's not lie, you'd probably eat everything, including the table. It's like a shoelace posing as meat. Very pliable. Aren't they supposed to be orange? Why can't I pierce it past a certain point? Pretty bendy. Is it really an egg? That is disgusting. I don't know what this hand meat is supposed to be. I wouldn't give that to my dog. How is that meat? That's rubber. Almost uh, a fifth of the entire day's sodium in this one packet. That's so bad. How did children eat this? One question I have is how did BuzzFeed get this food? Like did they go up to a school and order it? Or did they just pretend it's school food and make it themselves? It was actually way worse than I thought it would be. Everything felt a little rubbery. I'm really worried that this is what I depend on while I'm away from her. I just think about the kids who don't have access to meals and this is how they're gonna eat lunch. And I'm just kind of bummed out because this is what we're offering them and I think we can do better and we should do better. Moral of the story is if you care about your kids, just make them a PB&J. That's going to do it for today's video, guys. If you liked it, please like and subscribe. It helped my channel out tremendously, and you don't want to miss out on all my future uploads. And that's about it. Peace.